listen to me carefully, America. Listen to me. This, this may actually save your life someday. I want you to remember this. Whatever the government says to do, don't. If they say <laughs> gather someplace because it's all going to be good, we have all this medical aid and everything's going to be just come over here and gather, don't do it. We have a really beautiful place for you guys right behind this barbed wire right here. <laughs> really just don't there. do it. Great don't view. do it. Don't do it. I mean, just remember what they did with Katrina. Mm-hmm. Now, this is a far bigger disaster coming if these predictions by experts are true. Remember, I was the guy a year before Katrina, and I said the most dangerous city in America. You remember this? You remember how much trouble we got in or how much heat we got, how much, much they mocked uh-huh. me? Literally a year almost to the day, I said... Um, Uh, New Orleans is the most dangerous city in America. Forget about terror. I want you to think about a hurricane. If a hurricane hits New Orleans, here's what's going to happen. A year later, almost to the day Katrina hit, we weren't surprised, but they were. We weren't surprised at all. When it started to hit, when it looked like it was going that way, we dug up that old show, and I said, here's what I said a year ago. I'm telling you, get out of New Orleans. Get out of New Orleans. They didn't. The, 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 the government, the local and state government decided, no, nah, it's not a problem. This happens all the time. No, no, don't take a chance. Get out of New Orleans. Because if... It happens. You're in real trouble. So what did the government do? The government said after it was all too late, ah, come to the Superdome because we got everything under control there. Did they? This could save your life. Whatever the government says, hey, you guys, everybody come on over here. Don't go there. Don't go there. 